Good morning, everybody. Well, I said I was going to do it, and I'm going to do it. So I'm going to go on my first run. I'm not going far. I don't even know if I'll do two miles, but got to start somewhere, and that's today. Which is funny because there's the Disney half marathon going on today. So proud of all you guys that are running at Run Disney. And look at this dog. She just wants me to stay home and pet her. But I'm going to go try to knock out this run real quick so they can get started. Hey, you can tell me. <laughs> this is Sarah. She's resting. She's got a headache. I'll she... run someday. <laughs> she can run soon with me. I don't know. You're not going to do the dopey with me, though. I don't know. There's time. There is time. There's still time for Sarah to join. I think Sarah, I think we're both going to do the wine and dine this year, so she'll at least be running with me enough to do that. I did all two miles. I, did, I almost stopped, but I got to my door and I was like, I only have a little over of a quarter mile. And I was like, you know, let me just do it, you know. But I just if I start making excuses now on day one of training, it's not going to end up well. So I did two full miles. I know it's nothing. I know uh, the half marathons today, and there's people that have been training and running their whole life. But guess what? All starts at some point. People running the half marathon today and the dopey challenge this whole weekend. At one point didn't run, so, and I used to run. I did a half marathon in Chicago a couple years ago, so. No better time to start than now. How do you think it went? Yeah, that is the most important. I had a fun time too. I enjoyed your dad's little cameo in the beginning during setup. Uh, yes. But I had a lot of, a lot of fun. I think uh, I'm gonna shut off my vloggy here and we'll we'll talk about how you're gonna get these audio files over me because I want to I want to get this thing edited. And up tomorrow. Up tomorrow. What do you think? Today for this video, right? Yeah, today for this video. So hopefully it's up before this video because I'll have it edited and uploaded, and I don't know if I can upload it without post. I don't know. We gotta learn all that. Right. So it's been a little bit. It's actually late. We're gonna be leaving the house around five. It's almost like a regular day, but it's a Saturday, so we can stay out late. Well, we've been busy. We were productive. We needed one of these kind of mornings because. The holidays and everything were kind of behind on the regular stuff, laundry, other stuff like that. So we've done a lot of laundry, did the dishes, Sarah edited the vlog. We started our, Dom and I started our podcast today, which was super fun, super exciting. I'm really pumped about where that's going. Um, and that took a little bit longer than it's gonna take because uh, Sarah did all the design work when it comes to like thumbnails, logos and everything, because she's the best. I almost put this down to feed Eve instead of her like actual bowl. So, I just feel like really good. I know like it's gonna sound cheesy, but like I always, I love running. I used to run, a, we used to run when we were training for a half marathon a couple years ago and uh, I just have always loved running. You feel good, wake up early, do a little run, even if it's a half mile, just do it. Get the juices flowing. Look at this, I'm starving, but. Committed. Hello, everybody. Literally. Usually, Peter is vlogging while I'm on the phone. So today, I'm vlogging while he's on the phone. We just got to Disney Springs, where we have a BOGO for Blaze Pizza. So we're gonna try that out. We parked on the top of the parking structure, which I don't think we've ever done before. And the sunset is awesome right now. But to give you a a clue on our pizza. And hopefully it's good. We have one in Chicago, so we have been there before, but we have not been to the location here. So I hear the line is moves quickly, but this is what we're in. This is what we're in. And this was delicious pizza in Chicago when we had it. So I'm hoping even though it's super busy, they crank out good pizza. I think they will. Because they it was kind of like half this line in Chicago and it wasn't downtown this near Disney Springs. I made the mistake 
I thought this would be a quick line. It's been quick, but I thought it would be like you walk in the building. I didn't bring my sweatshirt that I brought. I left it in the car. So I got the green stripe, which has peppers and chicken and arugula. See, it's very healthy for you. And I got the white type, white top, which is cheese, pesto, Ooh, that was delicious. Peter's pizza tasted like Streets of America smells. Sarah has a hard time still with that that thing, that thing leaving. I wasn't as attached. But. I was a back lot. <laughs> a back lot. Oh, this is the didn't get the memo that Christmas is over. The tree is still up. And they're still playing Christmas music. And they're still playing Christmas music. But now it's time to go back to our car because I need my sweatshirt. And I think we're doing Magic Kingdom. And maybe, just maybe, Kristen or Kristen and Chelsea are gonna meet up with us. Okay, we don't always see this, so we have to show you. But here's the rolling, uh, the rolling piano. And she's got the the lamp from uh, Christmas Story on on the piano. See, she's just gonna roll away. Gonna roll on away. We also. We're not taking elevators anymore when there's a snare option. But we parked on the roof. So this is like second workout of the day. Because we just ate a pizza. Ooh, I almost stepped, tripped up the stairs. Sarah had a coupon for a free drink. She's winded. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> um, had that and then the buy one going free pizzas. And now we're back on this beautiful roof. And now we're here on Main Street, that great street. Let us know if you've ever heard the State Street song for Chicago. It's all about State Street, that great street. Kristen is meeting up with us. Yes. So we're gonna hang out on Main Street until she gets here? Yes, I think so. And we'll do some perusing, maybe some get some smells, look at some art. I hope she comes quick with that nice camera so we can play with it. No one else is. It is a fancy weekend because Kristen's with us a second day. And she bought her fancy new camera. So we're gonna go play with that and see if we can learn things and take fancy good shots. That's what we're up to. And we went to, we heard a rumor on the internet, and I think what, Twitter? Yeah. Somewhere on the internet, that Skipper Canteen was getting a free hot cider. Super jazz got there and it was not true. Cause you know our diet rule, we can accept things that are free. <laughs> Which is why we need to stay away from Disney Springs cause I'll eat 17 visits of Giardelli. But, Magic Kingdom look, got our back today and said no, uh, no, uh, no free hot cider. And all his pals at Monsters Incorporated Laugh Share fun. Wow. Better than a toe touch. <laughs> this is not my nor Sarah's style of hat, but that is 100% true. We just looked it up, and out of the 165 days that we've lived here, We've come to Disney property 136, 136 times. That darn hurricane, and, and we visited Chicago in there too, and a couple other places. And these socks are new. I need those in my life, and I need these in my life. You need those in my life. Kristen was so impressed. Come on, this is a trip. So we're called out to all the water that's usually hot in Apple. Yeah, so Before it's frozen over. All of the, we realized. But still cold? Yeah. We realized that all the water fountains were freezing cold. But Kristen had so much fun with her camera, and we showed her some tricks, and was just like playing with it with her around like the different spots. We really think she might start an Instagram tonight, so we'll let you guys know if she does. But she already was on her phone posting them as she was going to the monorail to get her car, or the Polynesian to get her car. Um, 
But she's so impressed, she had to leave. She's like, you know what? It was too much fun. I need to go look at these photos. I'm out. She was cold. She was cold. But we love her the same. Thanks for coming out, Kristen. But we, if you couldn't tell by the music, we're going to get some. We're going to steal some booty. I forgot to give you an update, change of scenery. We left Magic Kingdom and we are way down the road. We had some packages to send out and so we're actually at the post office to check our uh, P.O. box and send those packages. So just to, uh, nothing today. Always fun to check, never know what's in there. But we sent some packages out today and now it's time to go home. Sarah's in front of the mountain. But that's what our little update was and it's still cold. Look at that hat head. <laughs> Hair. Head, head. Busy, productive day, but it's late and we have a busy day tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So we're going to bed. Yes, indeed. Thank you for following along today. Um, we have fun, exciting things tomorrow. Actually, I don't know what we got planned during the second half tomorrow. Yeah. But we always have uh, try to find something fun to show you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So with that, it's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>